there's a time to show my face fitness and I like I bluntly like ask but with you know smile and politeness but like not beating around the bush so say uh, because remind me he was a potential candidate yes yeah okay so look I was interested in hearing people's opinions so if I were to ask you to be my partner what would be your opinion and I like I try to gouge his reaction hmm if you were to ask me right now I'd certainly be taken aback I would of course ask to get to know you better like I said I've always kept my distance out of respect for your father and our stations in life oh of course Especially what he's saying now. Yeah, get to know you better and then... Especially, and you'll just... And you'll just kind of look towards above your head. Especially with that guy around. Okay, and I slightly turn around to see who's he's pointing at. The rabbit, the, the hair is on your head. Oh, right. Uh, right, and I like... You know, my eyes go like up. Oh... Don't worry. I won't let him do anything to you. <laughs> so cool. Hmm. Well, like I said, I'm still an apprentice of your father, so I would imagine I still have some value in terms of my life. But, uh, but, uh, I, I suppose you've been told this many times before, but. You know, you need to feel that spark, I suppose. You're in it for the long haul, unless uh, I, I die tragically, but uh, I'm not planning on doing that. <laughs> Especially under Torajiro's guidance. Uh, I very much plan to be a part of the bulwark for the upcoming, for the upcoming forebodings. Of course, I wouldn't even dream of being a reason for your death, so I understand your answer. You're very considerate about that. And mm. am I to guess that your brother would give me this similar answer? Uteimon, he's, uh, he's a lot more reserved than I am, but we do feel the same sentiment. I'd feel, well, I'd feel like you're... Your open and warm nature would actually get him to open up a bit more. He's very talented. He'll probably be better than I am one day, but, well, he does have his um, reservations, like I said earlier. Of course. I was mostly asking in regards to this, this apprenticeship thing and that he also would, wouldn't probably like to be, air quotes, killed by my... Uh, Father, not that I would allow my dad mm. to do anything to you guys. And uh, he'll just kind of laugh, and you'll be like, uh, "No, I do suppose if you um, if you ask him, he'll be very uh, taken aback." But uh, don't say it came from me. I'm supposed to be able to keep keep a secret. And then I I do the like zip motion on my mouth. Don't worry, secret is safe with me. Mm. If you want to talk to him about this sort, uh, he's over by the pavilion. All right. He's been avoiding people. Hmm. I guess I will have to change that. Uh, I guess. Right. Uh, it was a pleasure talking with you. Uh, -san. Sorry, I forgot his name. <laughs> But I imagine I would still go by family name. Uh, Come on, uh, see you around. Hello. Hello. Yeah, Jess. Hey. Oh, I guess she's not here. I mean, I didn't uh -huh. hear an AFK or something, so... Uh, 
for a moment I thought my turn had dropped again, but... <laughs> Oh. Ah. I mean, I don't know. So far, I'm really inclined to just go with Suzu. Yeah. Even if she's a new character. <laughs> yeah, you're calm, man. Because Hamato... I mean... This is my philosophy that don't take easy choices, so Hamato wouldn't be an easy choice, but on the other hand, I'm not that... Eh... It's not that... Appalling to me. Yeah. Yeah. Don't force yourself into something you don't want to do, buddy. Yeah. yeah besides, I'm pretty sure Reiko won't be making choice during the clan summit. I had to go somewhere. Oh, okay. I'm glad you made it back. Safe and sound. What's the last thing you heard from me? I didn't hear anything because I got interrupted. Oh, okay. So I basically, like, say it said that thanks, uh, pleasure talking with you. Come on, see you around. Considering that I guess we have finished the talk. Yeah, let's virtually it. Okay. So I guess I go look for the older brother because we went with the younger one. We might as well finish the uh, all the options. But right. like, as I'm going towards the pavilion, I think he said, uh, I'm like, Hi. you know, looking around to see if I spot familiar face. AKA if I spot uh, Gideo. If not, that's cool. I'm just saying what Reiko does. Mm. You're near the edge of the blue quadrant. And, uh, can you roll me your diligence? Of course. I'd say a minus. I'd say a minus two because it is fairly busy and there will be people like mm -hmm. um, going up to you. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have anything to add to that. Nope. Nope, I don't think I have. Track and field nor navigation will help me. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Alright, so as you're making your way through, you'll hear a Reiko. Reiko, is it you? I mean, I, I knew you'd be here, but, well, I managed to find you. Oh, and then I like you know try to connect the voice to the name and like look around like hey and uh, you'll uh, you'll get the um you'll get the urge to sneeze I try to hold it back <laughs> and you hear purple so it's like hey <laughs> but mm. Um, well, Kesseran missed you at least. But what was that? Kesseran. Ah, this. Wait, who is? Kesseran. You... Is, is this my mother's persona? Yeah. Is this my mother? I mean. Yeah. As you turn around, you'll see your, you you'll see your mother there. And, uh, and, uh, oh and there's quite a few, there's quite quite a few people around, and she'll be like, uh, oh, Reiko, how are you doing? It's it's been a while since we've last got to see each other." Yeah, I obviously come closer, and you know, this, she is my mother, so obviously I'm happy to see her despite all of this. You know, family business and me going priest road, not... I think she's the techno, technological... Yeah, she's uh, she's part of the new family. Yeah. Uh, I'm like, hello, mother. Yes, it's... It's been a while. Sorry, mm. I say sheepishly. Uh, I imagine you've been busy with Jun. 
Oh, among other things, you know, Mirai Academy, uh, other stuff. Mm. Well, do you have some time? I understand being a Fujiwara, you'll have many people wanting to talk to you, of course. It was a... It was certainly a trek trying to find you within the blue quadrant, and even even with your standout looks. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, what's the time of the day, by the way? It's like four p.m. Ah, okay. Uh, I'm like, yes, of, of course. Mm. I thought you made it like that, yeah. It, Shame on me if I didn't make time for you, mother. Mm. Well, I understand how things are. If you, if you find yourself to be swept away for, by the events, well, I don't think anybody else could blame you for that. Uh, yes, uh, th thanks. Thank you, mother. So... Do you have a spot to talk, or do you want to discuss here? Um, whatever's more comfortable for you. I mean, I imagine, like, this might be, you know, other people, so I try to find a little bit quieter corner. Uh, right. So that we don't have to shout to each other. Hmm. Can you owe me your understanding? Of course. Do I add anything to that? Mm, no, it's just a general one. Okay. Alright, so uh, as you as you make your way over, you'll notice that there is a space. And there was a couple of other people occupying, but as soon as you as soon as you get up to them, you'll uh, you'll see them like like conscientiously notice you, and then they they'll get up and move away after 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 giving you a respectful nod. And behind you, there is another woman that's trailing you guys, and she's trying to not be spotted. Uh, okay, so to these guys that left me a spot, I I'm like slightly... kind of in that awkward, clumsy way, not in a ha ha Melissa sin way. Uh -huh. I'm like, like, the first side, like, I, you know, do the, like, I thank you and, like, bow. And then as I turn around and start saying, oh, Mother, here, this is the place, I, like, like look, you know, like, not over her, but she can probably see that I'm looking at something behind her. Uh, and I, I, like, like, squint my eyes and I'm trying to recognize that uh, person. You haven't seen her before, and uh, and your mother will be, uh, oh, oh, right. Uh, I told her to to keep back. She d d still doesn't know how these things quite work. Oh, so. I, I like wave. Hey, I don't bite. You can join us. She can join us, right, mother? <laughs> Um, that would be nice. She'll just kind of, uh, she'll kind of look relieved. Hey, come over here, like, you're welcome, and I'm, like, not, you're, I don't see you're welcome, that's strange in this case, in this context. So, does that person come closer? Uh, yeah, slowly. And uh, you'll see it's, uh, she looks in, like she's in her 30s and her hair is tied back and uh, she's, she's wearing the, she tried to put, put on like the traditional clothes but you can obviously tell they're store bought. Okay. And uh, she'll just be like, uh, hi, Reiko, your mother's told me quite a bit about about your duties and uh, and uh, and how you are and stuff. About my what? Duties. Yeah. Duties. Ah, uh, duties. Oh, 
I I was still the G G. <laughs> okay, I'm like. You said oh, that. Hi, it's, uh, hi. It's it's nice to meet you. I see you already know who I am. And uh, what's your name? And of course, I talk like her decently. I don't try to you know like come off as a, uh, aggressive and try to be respectful because well she's older than me. At least she looks like it. <laughs> Brutal. Hey, I'm speaking uh, the fact. <laughs> I'm, uh, Hanukkah. Uh, and, uh... Nice to meet you. And your mother will be like, uh, mm, Well, I suppose I was going to introduce you to her uh, sometime, but this is as good a time as ever. And uh, she'll just kind of look towards Katsumi, and then she'll look back, and she'll be like, uh, "Hanukkah is a dear friend of mine." And she'll just kind of smile. Mm, no, I won't ask for understanding because I already asked, I already stated it's my head canon that Reiko is very obvious to. In some cases, she's very obvious to love. Maybe not her own, but uh, so like I. Like, like, smile happily. Oh, uh, it's very lovely to hear, mother, that you have a, such a great friend. Hmm. Yes. Uh, myself and Tonica, we've, uh, well, we've gotten along swimmingly. Friendship and all. Ah, as I heard just before, friendship. Uh, the power of friendship. <laughs> I, yeah, but that, as I said, that's really uh, great to hear. Uh, and I look at right. Hanukkah. Uh, I'm happy to that my mother has uh, such a great friend in you. Thank you, uh, Reiko Chan. Uh, I'm really, really glad to hear that that you approve of our friendship. Of course. Right, right. And, uh, well, I heard that you go to Mirai Academy. That must have been, well, the entrance exams must have been pretty taxing. I heard that they they tend to be on the stricter side. And I, like, I scratch my head sheepishly. Uh, well, they certainly don't allow you to... Uh, slouch, but uh, I went from them with grit and determination. I would say, like, how jokingly. Uh, but I think it's a very nice place for, for those who work and stuff, yeah. Uh, but overall, my schoolwork is going nice. We had winter exams mm -hmm. not so long ago. I I stumbled on general subjects a little bit, but overall it went it went fine. Mm, that's good. That's good. Do you have a favorite subject, or are you still trying to figure that all out? Uh, I ponder for a moment. Well, I I have I sometimes feel that I have too much energy in my body, so I guess. Track and field, or rather, like athletics, is my my thing, so to speak. And I like I do like, you know, m not mocking, uh, like you know, sc scout uh, animation from Team Fortress 2 that he's running in the in place and checking his uh, pulse, something like that. <laughs> and. Uh... And uh, Hanukkah will just kind of laugh. It's a bit of an awkward one, like a bit of a horsey one. And she'll be like, uh, wow, he, I guess he must have been running along those beaches at the temple then, huh? Uh, uh, yep. I mean, not Ooh. only there, but oh right of course of course but uh i guess i tend to think of uh, i tend to think of situations in relation to their environment uh, 
I am. My speciality is uh, geology. That sounds interesting. Mm. I never making really got into it. right. Uh, like taking, it's mostly a bit boring. Taking soil samples, examining the rocks. Uh, occasionally, you might get a fossil, but no dinosaurs, I'm afraid. <laughs> I was, uh, I was quite surprised uh, that uh, most of these things are fabrications of our mind. But your mother has been very uh, welcoming when it comes to uh, explaining all of these concepts to me. That's, I look at mother, uh, good, to fi uh, good to hear, and then I like look back at uh, Hanaka, well, I guess that means you are a very meticulous and uh, patient person to deal with, you know, all of that stuff. Mm, I suppose it's not exactly a mainstream job, but... I guess uh, I guess I do have job satisfaction, <laughs> and uh, I guess your your mother will be like, uh, right, right. Well, I'm certainly glad to hear that you're doing well in school. I did happen to take a peek at the uh, at the results. There was a uh, public version for well, well for um for people to look at. I didn't knew that, but uh, not that. Surprise! I mean, after all, you are my mother. I'm pretty sure my father also could take a look. As I said, a little bit stumble in general subjects. Mm. Well, well, we. I'm very proud of you, Rico. Your mother will create herself. Oh, I. I. Thank you, mother. Uh, do you have any? Plans for 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 the rest of your break. Uh, and like I could like have no reason to conceal that and honestly say, oh, there was like still one person, the thing on one older Conway brother, that I wanted to have a few wor words with. I've been you know, getting around the idea of having a. Uh, Tengu partner this entire bonding thing. I'm not gonna make a. I don't think I'm gonna make a decision during the summit. But it's always good to know where you stand, so to speak. Hmm. Are you really ready for that, Reiko? Like your mother will just kind of scowl when she hears this. I track and I, I wonder for a moment. I mean, I don't feel like, I'm not feeling like I'm not ready, if that makes sense. Uh, I mean, I said I'm not going to make a decision now, and I, I know, I know that this is a decision that you cannot change and you're in it for a long haul, but who knows, maybe I will find the right, right, right person. And she'll just kind of shake her head and you'll be like, it's a decision that you don't have to make. I know you mean well in, your, in what, you've, what you believe you're doing is right, but, well, Jen has always been, well, he's always had a, a plan in mind. You don't need to play along. We do have a, we do have a place. It's, uh, it's in a nice area, a bit. Uh, distance due to due to the work that I do I but uh, if you ever if you ever feel like uh, you you want to come visit sometime or if you need a break from this all we'll, we'll be happy to accommodate you you're still my daughter after all of, of, of course I was still my mother <sighs> like and like yeah, visibly, like, Reiko is, like, you know, wincing a little bit, and this is visible internal str struggle. I mean, I 
I don't know if I met you or not, but you know, I look at her, I just don't want to feel like I'm choosing. And then I like stop because I remember that I technically chose my father when I went bridge to the road and it kind of stings my heart. And I'm like, as in, like, saddened a little bit. And then I say, and, uh... and I thank you for your, and I do deep side, thank you for your offer, mother. I'll definitely remember about it. And uh, she'll just be like, uh... And I do mean that, Jen. And she'll look straight towards the rabbit. Uh, and then, like, because Reiko, I think she thought that the rabbit was, uh, like, the guardian spirit of the family, right? Uh, she didn't assume that my father could potentially use him as a you know, looking glass. I I guess I guess uh, the white hair Rinova is pretty much a, one of the main stories in Okunusi's uh, myth. It's a part of his persona. Yeah, sadly, I either I forgot about that or I didn't like uh, read his myth or something. Or I tend to forget stuff as a player, not a uh, character. Uh, so like, yeah. Like I now I have no idea what to say in character. There's like sputter and. And the Katsumi is visibly angry. Ah, God damn it. Uh, yeah, actually, actually, that what I will, that thing I would like to know. Can I make an understanding call to see at what or whom she's, Katsumi is angry? Yes. Do, yeah. I feel, do I feel anger aimed at me or at somebody else? Okay, so would I add my Katsumi modifier to this role or not? Yeah, you would. Okay, so understanding plus three. Okay, 12. Is she angry at me or at my mother? She's, she's angry towards your mother and her friend. Okay, uh, like trying Slightly anxious. I'm not good at hiding my emotions, so I'm like, Ish. yes, I will definitely remember about your offer, uh, mother. I perhaps it will be like, yes, yeah, I remember about your offer. Okay. <sighs> Well, I hope you do. I understand that uh, there's a lot of pressures when it comes to who you were born to and why you were born, but that really doesn't matter at the end of the day. I was hoping I could see you here since getting into contact with you is difficult. Uh, yes. Shit, like out of character. Shit, she's playing to think that Draco likes to hear that you are not bound by your birthright. Shit! So it's like... Uh, oh, of course. Uh, uh, I'm like still seeing that uh, Kasumi is so angry. Uh, I'm sure we might have... like No, we might have... I'm sure we'll have a... We'll catch each other... Later, there's a, you know, a thing I uh, still need to do, but I'm sure we'll find each other. Well, I hope so. Uh, I shall probably give you, I give you 
a couple of numbers. So, if you want the rabbit to be gone, I'm sure Kesharan can blow it away. It will be temporary. I'm not as strong as your father. Uh, at least, though. No, like, Reiko, like, in her mind, she's like, well, he'll blow it away, but then rub it well. Well, father will still see what happened with the idol. Feel it. So it's like, there's no, no fighting, no fighting, even between personas. Numbers will be uh, fine, mother. Hmm. Very well. It will give you a folded piece of paper. Try not to open it here. I, Reiko definitely didn't plan on, plan on doing that. Uh, uh, thank you, mother. Uh, Don't worry. The dust, that's, it, it's dusty for a reason. Don't clean it off. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Uh, it was good, good to see you, mother. Nice meeting you, uh, Honoka. And... Hanukkah's just sitting on the with her hands in her, with her face in her hands. Like she's kind of shivering, she's really nervous. Uh I guess, um, it was still nice meeting you. I met me not a word. Uh well and <sighs> Yeah, but I hope you'll enjoy your stay at the summit. Uh, and uh, your mother will be like uh, no it's fine uh, I achieved what I wanted by coming here so we can make our leave now we wouldn't want to uh, dampen the festivities after all There's still, I still believe there's a sense of community here that will be good for you you wouldn't want to find yourself uh, mixed up in the wrong in the wrong ideas or the wrong people Uh, right. Like, this is the thing that Rekos is wishing to has no idea what to really say without forcing this situation. It was uh, nice, it was nice meeting you, mother, and like, I will beat my, uh, farewell. All right, and uh, your mother will just kind of, she'll get up and uh, she'll put her hand on your shoulder and she'll be like, uh, Remember, if you if you ever feel like uh, you want to come back home, I'm always there for you. I don't. No, you'll, you'll find out one day. I'll take the. I suppose it would be a conventional exit in this environment, and she'll just kind of lift up her hand, and uh, there'll be like a swirl of dust, wind, and both her and Honiga will be dark gone. Okay. Uh, like, huh? And then, like, right, blink <sighs> inside, turn around to uh, Katsumi, and then, and then and, uh, she'll just kind of look at the. She'll just kind of hold her hands, and she'll look at the ground, and she'll be like, uh, "Well, that was most unfortunate." I mean, Rico for a moment would ponder, and then I, you're right, the, uh, well, sorry if that my talking with mother you know, up, upset you. I know, I try not to think about that, you know, this thing between my father and my mother. She's, she's still my mother, and, you know, I would feel bad, bad if I didn't talk with her. Mm, of course, uh, a, a, the bond between a mother and her daughter is not something that can be replaced. <sighs> Still, that was most improper. Uh, in a way, how I conducted? Like she'll I'm, just kind I'm of confused. shake her head. And she'll be like, uh, I guess marriages do have their rocky points in this modern world. I mean, 
What? Like I, I look confused and my naivety will play out. What? Average thing. I mean there's Hanaka-san, her friend, but she didn't mention anything about her uh, husband. Oh, no, wait, because my <laughs> Fuck! Jesus, I dare completely. Ah! Yeah, retcon that. What I say instead uh, is that, well, yeah, I mean, my father and my mother don't exactly look. I, I just finally think, ah, and I like, I, like, my hand goes through my face, and I'm like, ah, I don't exactly want to talk that much about it. I no, my... no, my drop to my comfort hall. Give me a moment, I'm going to turn the light on. Okay. I don't know why my brain for a moment like completely missed the fact that you fucking idiot, your father is married to your mother or he was. What? <laughs> Excuse me, man. <laughs> Matt, you okay there, buddy? Yeah, I know. I my my brain went completely what like. What the fuck? Wait, what? <laughs> Good one. All right, my character's mother is married to my character's. <laughs> you did it, Matt. Good thing it. I'm proud of you, kid. Yeah. You solved the case. As I said, my brain went full derp mode. Yeah. Um, or alternatively, full retard, as uh, yes. R Robert Downey Jr. said in Tropic Thunder. I would Thunder. say so. Yes, I would say you went full retarded. <laughs> oh, Alright, so when, uh, so when, uh, when you when they disappeared, the rabbit just jumped off your head and started popping away. Uh, I don't try to stop it. Oh, well, there he goes. All right, and is that? I guess the, you wouldn't have enough time to talk to the younger one. You got uh, you got diverted. One. The younger one. You spoke to the older one. Right, I chose the older, but I think yeah, because we are where when we are discussing with him, I I don't know why I understood that I was talking to the younger one. Never mind. No. It was the older one. Yeah. So I guess you'll retire for the night. And uh, Katsumi will just kind of, she'll be, she, her mood is pretty shit now. She'll just be stone cold. And uh, she'll suggest we should probably make our way back. We'll have an early morning tomorrow. Uh, 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 of course. And then I right. honestly have no idea how in this environment I can do anything to make her mood better, I guess this is something that would pass in time. Alright, and I guess I guess as you're um as you're getting your you're getting your rooms or well, your room's been made ready. And uh, I guess uh, what's your fucking name again? I guess ABC would be like uh, he would just kind of hold out a cup of sake. Okay, I take it. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Abisu. He will not. Uh, He'll point to a bubble and like and tilt his head inquisitively. Wait, he did. But I'm not sure if I understand what's going on. What what bubble? Well since he's done this a lot, he's talking about whether you want to talk to the fish or not. Oh right. Uh Sure. He always uh, offers right. advice and stuff like that. All right. So he'll take thing. off his he'll take off his bubble helmet, and then a coral will appear and he'll be like, "Group, group, group. What's the matter, Rico? Ah, uh, you know, I 
met met with my mother first time since uh, uh well for since quite a while and Ooh. well that kind of sort the mood of Katsumi Ooh. Oh that's real that's a shame Mm. Did you like seeing your mother? I mean, of, of course, she's she's still my mother. Mm. Uh, the, the family ties the, the same blood between the two of us. No, it's mm. something that cannot be easily broken. Mm. Even if I did choose the path of my father. Mm, that's true. It can't easily be broken, but it can still be bruised. Good. Well, yeah. I mean, ah, uh, I no, I I don't like being put in the situations when I actually have to choose between my mother and my father, and I can't keep both of them happy, you know. No. But there was one thing that they agreed on. Blump, blump. Oh? What was it? You're the agreement. Blump, blump, blump. I just like that. Oh. Oh. And then, like. Like I. To this side. Oh. And then, like, I. I, I never doubted that they, that they care about me. In their own ways. Uh, thanks, Akaro, that you said it. Blum, blum, blum. You should do what you want to do because mm, people should try to be happy. Glum, glum. And try not to. Blum, blum, blum. Well, mm, I don't know. Try to find the best path for my life. Boom. Boom. Yes. Boom. Sometimes people will be sad. Sometimes people will be happy. You can't stop that. Boom. Of course. I mean... What I want to do. I mean, this thing with being the potential empress, I heard and, you know, my thing was, I, you know, I'm not a selfish person, I like to help people and make things better to, I guess, to lead by an example. And I, it's not that I'm, I'm feeling bad with my current role as a priest. I, I don't know, it's just uh, serious stuff that I have to... Do you want to be a Fujiwara? I mean... That's a... That's a weird question. I mean, I don't dislike being a Fujiwara and I... I, I like being a Fujiwara. Do you know what it means to be one, Gloom? To be a guide, to offer spiritual guidance to people. No, that is wrong, Gloom. Yeah, I tilt my head so. But in your opinion, Akoro means to be a Fujiwara. Hmm, that you... Uh, by your birthright, gloom gloom, imperial gloom gloom, that you can trace your ancestry gloom back to Jinmu himself gloom gloom. Jinmu was the product of the sea gloom gloom. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, it just cracked me up this 
Like, like, oh, the Akaro, the best fish, never change. Uh, uh, right, right. So, oh, right, I think I did that with Koharu. So, her past, something like that. I saw something, but I guess she saw more. Oh, I mean, as long as it can help people. Mm. Yes, Glum Glum. The Fujiwara are royal, Glum Glum, are imperial, Glum Glum. They became the Fujiwara because they used to be the Nakatomi, Glum Glum. It, to be a Fujiwara is to rule, Glum. Mm, I win, so it will be it. Uh, I guess. And then I like I, you know, start trying to rationalize it to myself as something good that I can see positives in it. Well, as in the past, there were kings or rulers. There could be bad, but there could also be good ones. I f I think I could be a a good one. You know, to lead by an example, I guess. Um. You're not alone, though, Glum Glum. Mm, you have me, Glum Glum. And then I, I know it doesn't like work, but I like, just, like you know, try to pat a curl. Uh, I know, I know that they are the best, best fish companion. And then I like, I raise my cup of sake and like to you know to a bisa and not. Of course, I have a bisa too. I have Katsumi. I have my friends at academy. Of course, I'm not alone. Yes, gloom, gloom. Mm. When it comes to gloom, gloom, preserving the Minamoto, gloom, gloom. Well, you're like the ocean itself. Perfect. A miracle, gloom. Mm. Mm. Well, I would definitely like to make some miracles. Miracles. But I guess that will come in time. I I say that like half seriously, meaning that I break out one. She wouldn't object doing something great for mm. herself and somebody else. Too bad I'm not a Tengu, Glum. I'd be your retainer. But I am a fish. I mean, you still help me. Still go to fights with me, I guess. Not I guess, I still go. You're still my companion. Yes. The voice of Ebisu. Gloom. And Okoro, me. Voice of me too. Gloom. <laughs> uh, yes, yes. I mean, would that be considered, and I say quietly, if I ask, like, why? Uh, although, before I ask this, because I don't want to sound like an idiot again, out of character, would Reiko know the legend behind Ebisu and why Ebisu doesn't talk? E have you asked him before? Or have you asked the Koro? Uh, you know what? Let's say no. So yeah, now's the time to ask? I will ask it now. So, sorry if that's something considered a Koro, but I...